Welcome to the Currency Index Market Report. Good morning and welcome to the last uh, market report of the week from Currency Index. Uh, we've had a bit of a roller coaster ride this week for the pound uh, on the currency markets uh, as a result of some quite conflicting data out. Uh, inflation numbers earlier on in the week seem to uh, cast doubt as to whether the Bank of England would need to raise interest rates as soon as they might have indicated um, last week. But um, then the actual minutes of the Bank of England's meeting for this month came out showing that two members had voted for a rise now. So um, a little bit contradictory and uh, subsequently the pound has uh, dropped a bit, come up a bit and uh, been a little bit uncertain as the week has gone on. Uh, the big winner this week has been the uh, US dollar as we've seen for a few weeks now. Uh, US figures coming out quite positively. Um, everyone a lot more bullish about the US economy generally. Um, today, there's not a lot of data of any note, uh, unless you're Canadian, where there's some uh, retail sales and CPI inflation coming out from Canada. Possibly the reason for that is that all the central bankers are holed up in Jackson Hole um, in the US, uh, having a bit of a conference out there. Uh, we've got some quite key speeches coming out from that uh, meeting uh, today, one from Janet Yellen and one from Mario Draghi. Um, Yellen is expected to talk about the US labour markets and uh, generally positivity towards the US uh, economy. Mario Draghi's got a much harder job to try and persuade people that he's uh, got a good handle on what's happening in the Eurozone and has a good plan to make it um, step forward in the way that the UK and the US economies have. Um, doesn't seem to be working at the moment, but we'll have to wait and see uh, what he's got to say. Um, so expect probably quite a lot of focus to be on those meetings and markets to move as a result. Uh, the dollar is likely again, I would imagine, to be the winner as a result of that and the euro possibly the loser. So. Uh, for those of you with a currency purchase coming up, make sure you uh, stay in touch with us here at Currency Index and we'll be able to keep you informed on what's going on and what your options are as a result. Have a good weekend. We'll be back next week. Visit currencyindex.co.uk to save money on your next currency exchange or call us today on 0800 043 2623.